Hello guys and welcome back to another video with me Slivers FX and this Gothic 2 New Balance mod. Today we are continuing the Masia of Slayer. This is going to be part 2. Last time we became Murat of the three masters. The main master is still yet to talk to us but he will get there. The next part is we're going to talk to Tiamant and he's going to give us a quest for killing one of the elite shadows called Hasin, The one that we gave the, one of the purses from Osair to. Okay, so what we're going to do is basically lure out Hasim into the open and uh, make sure that he follows us by choosing the right option. And this option is Prior Osir wants to see you. Or Prior. And once you get out of this building basically and into the woods, he's going to ask you why have you stopped and then you're going to tell him why. And we just one-shot him. <laughs> okay. So, Osair... Sorry, uh, Tiamant wanted him dead. So, we're going to tell him that he's he's gone. And let's see what the next quest after that is. How's my task? <laughs> Okay, the next order of business is to clear the mine where we were supposed to avoid in the first place before coming here. Uh, and this time there's going to be a, f a couple of ore crawlers there because the one elite shadow couldn't handle all of them. So now everybody in there is dead. And that would be uh, the little... Uh, the little wink, as we call it, right here. There's like, what, five of them? Oh, actually, six. And we took care of them with ease, no problem whatsoever. We can grab all the iron, iron ore if you want to. And that's about it. We can now go back to Tiamat, I think. Alright, let's see what's next. So it's just a matter of time. I might be able to become one of the Masi of Success and that will unite agree. Okay. I think now I am, will be interested of Hanyer the Blind. So, that's the uh, main master. He might talk to us alone. Uh, not silently. Very good. Very recently, have you heard it? And uh, say, mm, I know about the fact that he is dead. I know that he naturally, but the effort, of course, it won't uh, join in. And if you find, all right. So now you need to find out who killed Hasim, even though it was you. Let's save up here. Uh huh. We need to talk to Gonzalez first before we continue with anything else. And it's gonna be nighttime, so we're gonna have to switch to day as well soon enough. We have a sleep that doesn't work. Oh, yes. Okay. What does it say? Gonzalez was quite puzzled by the situation. The only thing we could suggest was to either talk to Tiaman or try to tell the truth. Either way, it's my choice. <clears throat> the um, correct way of doing this is by talking to Tiaman and he's going to give you a letter. And then you choose the right option with Hanyar. This is Tiaman, in case you're forgetting.
And make sure you try to save before every main uh, dialogue with these masters because otherwise they're just gonna kill you on the spot. There you go. Um, I have a letter from you from Pirate Diamond. And I decided to get to the bottom of the situation first. No, I got a little confused. No, unlike Tiaman's words, my word is worth little. I'm afraid even if all the that is the right choice. So don't stand. We're gonna go into the temple. Sorry, we're gonna go to the woods and we're gonna pray for Has Hasim's uh, death for his soul. It's kind of funny. Lord of Purple Darkness. <laughs> Alright, so we prayed for Hasim's life or soul. We're gonna go back to Gonzalez real quick. Now we can go back to Hanyar again. As mentioned in the previous video, there's gonna be a lot of running around and a lot of dialogues, and the killing comes later. So Hanya is here. Okay. So he's gonna go outside and we're gonna talk to him there. I'm gonna save just in case. Sometimes I make a mistake of choosing the wrong dialogue. Or dialogue in this case. It goes all the way outside. All the way away from prying eyes or um, eavesdropping from other people. You could just kill him right here on the spot if you wanted to, but the point of this is to get all the quests done, right? Are you afraid of death? No. Okay. Okay, I... So we're gonna get a letter that we need to read. He says, find out what the other priors of the Brotherhood think of Tiamant. There's a lot of stuff going on inside this area and a lot of, uh, a few things are gonna spawn a few people. This one is the first one. Wait a minute. I'm gonna pickpocket him, ask him who he is, what is he doing here, and why is he upset? You give him a Mervitan Fang that you killed earlier. And you can also ask him what he has to offer. I think there's another uh, Masyaf assassin or novice in the cave of Osiris Lair. I believe so. There you go, Jacqueen. And you help him get uh, to Osair quicker. Okay, we've talked to Joquim. The, la the day has passed. We're gonna go back to the main temple of the Masyaf Slayer and see what else can we see. I'm ready to become a shadow of Masyaf. So we need to wait until noon to become one. So we're gonna sleep until four hours have passed. We can even do five, actually. And, uh, I think this will also benefit us. Right. Whenever, and what, then... Now we just have to wait for all the masters to arrive here and we get our new outfit. We're not gonna have a novice outfit anymore. You can put this on maximum speed. Diamant's already here. Uh, Osiris is also here, but Anrosas is yet to come. Just make sure uh, when they're all in position, you just uh, wait or move in a certain direction to, to the center. And now you have a new outfit. You never get the elite one, but you get the Osair one. I'm not even sure if you can buy an elite one.
Okay. Now you can also get learning skills from these guys if you want to, if you haven't maxed out everything already. But yeah, uh, let's see. I don't think Osir has anything to say to us yet. We're gonna try anyway. Wait a minute. No. Uh, we're gonna wait until Hanyar actually leaves the uh, temple. For that, I'm gonna have to sleep through several hours. And there you go. He's outside now after 3 p.m. I have information. Okay, that's one down, a few to go. Let's see what we have to say. I think one of the things we need to do is go talk to Gonzalez again. Now we're gonna go to the center in the temple and see if the other two masters might have any work for us that hasn't been done yet or haven't finished. Where do we f talk to uh, to this guy? I believe there's nothing else that we can do. Osir doesn't have anything for us. I don't think Tiamant even has anything for us. Oh, he does actually. Uh huh. The new slaves for the mine. Let's see if if Androsos has any. He can only teach us some stuff. Is there anything special that he can teach us? Uh, how to handle poisons? Okay, we already learned that from Constantino. So in case you haven't done the Constantino quest, you can learn it from him. Now we need to go to a side escape again, and tell him about the the new. Slaves that need to go into the mine. Are you sure? There can therefore get me at least one spec. All right, cool. Now we need to go to the cave where the gold was found earlier. I think I heard a scavenger again. <laughs> That's why I turned around for a second. We're gonna go back into the cave and see if there's some gold. Why there's... Oh, there's a mine crawler in here. That's what I'm hearing. Okay, nice. So, the cave of gold is here. And this is uh, Luke Skywalker, apparently. And he's gonna try and kill us. Uh, but we're not gonna let him. And we're gonna get a piece of rock from one of the gold mines. And we're gonna, gonna return to... Osair. I think next to go now. Of course. So where is that slack? Okay, we're gonna talk to Joquim again. That is near the uh, the uh, statue of Belier. What are the, the what, yeah, a Then I guess I said I would be interested to know something about then you. Ahead. That's it. Of what is this? the prior to No Hanya would be interested in hearing what uh we just found out. recent days and now he is asking a sire for new if someone attacked all the slit oh so that it turns out I did what please for there is one thing that we forgot to check out before talking to Hanyar and that is actually Luke's scroll and Luke was planning to kill me as always I was in the wrong place at the wrong time Tiamant uh, I'm not sure how that relates to anything but 
I know why Hakusim was killed. And it's basically because of the gold mine that is in the uh That's in the cave. And what was nothing good. So of course not. Firstly, only and secondly, all the no, I will do everything. And now that's we might have to go to Osir to uh, continue questing since uh, the Amman's ex execution won't happen until later. Aha, uh -huh, the slaves are now here. Let's just rob them real quick. And we'll accompany them to the, to the mine. Alright, let's lead them. Make sure they are following you, otherwise it can be a pain. Uh, why are you not? Okay, now he's following me. Good. Sometimes he can le get left behind, and then when you come back, he's not even there. Come on, Jokwim. Uh, the easiest way to go is to go a little bit around, not directly, so they don't have to jump, or they don't have to climb anything. Sometimes they get stuck. And getting to the mine is not that difficult, but... Yeah, it can happen that some, some of them might die of unnatural causes. There you go. I forgot that there's black goblins there. I'm gonna get rid of some mine crawlers as well. Should be another one. I think I killed them all, actually. Never mind. Come on, kill them already. I don't want to hit something by mistake. Thank you. And that's the last mine crawler as well. And let's lead them directly into the uh, gold mine. Another ore crawler, and uh, I think that's the last of them. Okay. And then you talk to Jacquim and tell him you're here. And now you have to wait on this small stone. And some elites will appear in a minute or so. There we go. The waiting has is over, and now the elites appear. And now we have to report to Osair. There's two elite shadows here that you can rob again, because they just appear out of nowhere, out of thin air. So we're gonna go back to Osair and tell him that the slaves are now guarded by the elites. And once that is, is done, I think we can watch how Ta Tiamat is gonna die by the hands of Hanyar. Let's go see the uh, the battle now. There you go. We're here. If you listen closely, you can actually hear a conversation, but the music's too loud. I suppose you don't know anything about Let me see. I can lower the music volume and increase the sound. No. Want to confuse me? You can answer the question yourself. I don't believe a single word you say. Don't have even bigger problems. I bet you're responsible for this. This is a bad idea. You should have listened to me. You don't want to understand this, do you? Your end has come. You're going to die now. Show me what you're capable of. I 
will stab you. That was easy. <laughs> now, even if you put this at times three speed, the uh, the slow motion camera around the perimeter is still going to be doing its thing. So you, you just have to wait it out. There's no way around it. Now we're going to go talk to Hanyar again. Possibly a lot of one and other and what happened far nothing me by the way it seemed to have looked so up okay cool so it is very mysterious that uh hanyar killed tiaman so easily considering he was the weapon master but hanyar has a few tricks up his sleeve so one of the one of the priors is dead i brought the sword of tiaman i have a question I, 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 for you okay. And he tells you his past now, finally. That he was also one of the priors. But and he wants to redeem himself by... Well, later he goes to the monastery and he becomes a novice. No, that would be first ever. Alright, that's it from Gonzalez. Apparently, prior Osair was looking for us as well. And he will probably want that quest where he uh, he needs new fighters for his uh, well, for his group. Did you look for me, master? You. Then. But if it, that's why. I, and of course. And why don't you? Lately. Uh, I'm regard. I hope. Let's see what we have to do. I don't know, I want to be a powerful. Okay, so we need to get a powerful potion from Unroses. And make sure it is done correctly. There's a lot of things that can go that can go wrong within this temple, but the worst thing that can happen is that you kill everybody, <laughs> or they kill you. Whatever happens first. I help me. Okay, so. We're going to have to test this poison first before we even give it to Osair, and that's by killing a troll with it. We're going to talk to Gonzalez first. Hey, what? And we're going to sneak our way through. Even though we have invisibility, this still works if you don't have invisibility. There's going to be a carcass here of a scavenger. And we'll be able to put half of the poison vial to kill the troll. And then basically move away in the same crouching position. And the troll will grab the bait and it's gonna get killed. There you go. And you get a troll tongue by doing so. You can talk to Gonzalez again. And we go back to Rosas, who will give us the approval and give us another vial for Osair. So that has to be some strong poison, huh? <laughs> there we go. We're here. Hold on. There's enough poison here. Thank you. All right. We can go back to Osair, who will give us a special wine for Androsas. But that wine is poisoned. So we have to take it to Hanyar before we do that. Boom. Can I participate in the next expedition? No. Alright. Right. Wine Tear of Beliar received. So we don't only have Tears of Enos in the game. We also have Tear of Beliar.
We're gonna go to Hanyar first. What do you mean? And he tells you that that wine is actually poisoned. I think. Let me see. We have to wait until the next day. He gives us the wine back. One moment. Let me save. Let me wait until morning. If not, then uh, we'll just... Uh... Oh, Hanya is going outside anyway. We'll just go to Anrosas instead. Oh, my fears were completely ah, yeah. I thought so. You have to wait until he goes outside so he talks to you. Okay, now we deliver everything. The wine and the message that Osai wrote directly to Anrosas. And he just disappears. Kind of funny. Okay, nice. Um, let's see, I think he gave us a letter. Oh, the Dance of Two Blades. That's from Tiaman. Never mind. Uh, let's go see Osair now. I have great. In the meantime, I wrote a I Okay, so this is the letter for Osair. Keep mistaking that one for Anrosas because Anrosas just disappears. We should be able, be able to finish this soon. As uh, we go to Osair, Osair will get killed by Hanyar and then, well, what we have to do is just kill the last uh, master or prior. That's weird. He didn't give us the quest of hiring new people for him. Bizarre. I don't think we skipped it or anything. Well, excellent. I hope that he will. F As for you, now and after I settled the matter with. If your life is dear to you, this is the. If your life is dear to you, you will stay out of it. Okay. Let's see. I think we have to go to the cave now, where the people there are going to tell me to stay away. No, we're not. Uh, we have to go to Gonzalez first and tell him about it. I have some interest in spilling. It seems. He asks us where that might be. So now we check that out. They're gonna tell us to move, turn away. Well, actually, we could. Let me see if this works, just for the lols. If we sneak past by them with invisibility. And I'm gonna rob them just in case. By the way, the invisibility has been nerfed a little bit. It has a timer now, how long it can be active. I think it depends on how uh, much dexterity you have. Oh look, there's nobody there. Surprise, surprise. <laughs> I thought they would be here, but they're not. Uh, so we're gonna sneak behind them again. I was just waiting for the uh, disappearance cooldown, the invisibility cooldown to run off. And we're gonna go... Wait. Oh, he's already following me. It's the Let's go. Oh, he's using a bow this time, huh? About that. Okay, so now that these guys appeared, it's five massifs against 
Anya and three demons. And the demons just clearly win here, no problem. And the thing is, Osair died before this elite. It's kind of funny. The elite uh, lasted longer. And again, with this spinning camera thing, it, it's kind of annoying, uh, honestly. What it Did you well, well, we have to go down there and kill the demons. We could kill him easily here already, but he teleports away, same as Raven does. And now it's time to end all of this. Where'd he go? Hey! Who are you targeting, bro? <laughs> Wait a minute. Okay, we get 5000 experience and now it's time to kill everything else that we have been uh, waiting for. We're gonna clear out the Masia's Lair, that's the last of the quests. I'm surprised that one of the quests was just forgotten somehow. Uh, the one where we uh, get four new fighters for Osair. But I guess. So we're gonna kill this guy. Okay. Nice. I don't know where Gonzalez went. Oh, hello. He was behind us, but sometimes he just gets lost. Maybe he's here. No, he's not. I guess we'll just do it alone. He's gonna appear eventually. But what I have to do is clear out this whole temple now. It doesn't matter, um... Because we have a bounty on our head, basically, at this point. One, two, three, four, five. Нравится? Ну давай, покажи уже на что ты способен. Novices, shadows, everybody dies. Oh, Gonzalez is actually there. How about that? Oh. He doesn't have a sword. That's fun. That's fantastic, bro. That's why he's using a bow, because he doesn't have a sword. That's funny. Say, so we are. There's a couple of more Masias around, assassins, I mean. But I'm gonna just check out the scenery. Oh, hello. Who are you? And where did you come from? That's one. That's two. I think there's like a couple of chests left, but other than that, there's nothing much to pick up here. Uh, the Will of the Wisp starts working once you actually kill everybody. But there's one thing that it won't pick up, and that is this scroll over here that you need to read. Uh, let me see if I can give it to Gonzalez. Yeah, don't read it just yet. Uh, interact with the... Interact with the Belliar statue, and this thing will open. And then go talk to Gonzalez again. And when once that is done, you can basically change your outfit. I had the El Hazir armor. You also get the Prior of Masia. But it, it's uh, strength based, so I don't have enough strength to show you. But I have the El Hazir armor and its helmet. Which looks pretty dope, 
I don't remember which game this is taken from, if any at all. But I really like it. And it gives you a lot of health. Um, a lot of stuff that's going to be in here can be, of course, taken. A lot of money. A lot of other stuff. There you go. I think that's all of it. Uh, let's see. So you get the, any special weapon here? No. We do have one of the best weapons in the game anyway. But we do get a troll potion, a dexterity potion, and a life elixir of life. I think that's enough. I mean, I already have almost 7,000 HP. I'm gonna save his because this thing in the middle is actually a teleport. And these guys hit pretty hard if you don't have enough armor. But what I'm really interested in how easy I can take these guys out. Pretty easy. <laughs> We're gonna take both of these little um, levers down and the new... Uh, Thing is gonna open here. I think we can take this. No, we can't actually. But Hanya is already waiting for us. We're gonna save again. Make sure you can kill him easily enough. Hey. And Gonzalez comes walking in. And he's gonna help us. Well, he's not gonna really help us with the fight because I think he goes unconscious after this. At least he did in my previous run that I was doing solo. So you find the but in Yep. He goes. Who will prevail? That was easy enough. Even though he had the help of um, four, four uh, demons that would provide him health, it wasn't enough. It was not enough. We can still heal up here before we encounter the demon. You, I don't think you can even talk to the demon. He just starts attacking you. Yeah, he just starts attacking you. There you go. And the last boss... Is actually Korkalom from Gothic 1 that disappeared after uh, Iberian was killed. Yeah, and, here is our... and he becomes a servant of Beliar basically. Come on, die already. I don't know. I don't even know why he bothers. Like, I do so much damage at this point that even if I would be playing on normal, that'll be kind of insane. He didn't even have time to spawn the last thing, which was a, uh, I think one of those uh, undead servants, not just a demon. Okay, let's see. We got anything important in here, or did the Will of the Wisp already pick that up? I think it picked that up already. Let's see, we got the wine of the golden, the golden wine that we could have picked up. We got the uh, Guru's inspiration and Guru's breath. I haven't done this Guru's breath yet. I probably should. Uh, Elixir of spirit. Anything else that it's important? No. Hmm. I think we can now peacefully leave, and that's by interacting with this unusual rune stone. And it's gonna teleport us directly back to the front of the cave where we left off in Corinus. Glad to see you alive. Howdy. 
some Wait a minute. So he's gonna go Wait back to the are, to the monastery. Look, how are you? And we are gonna finish this quest. It's gonna rob these two Templars. You can get to a thousand pickpocketing level, basically, if you interact with every single person that you encounter in the game. Uh, where is Balnamip? Where is Balnamip, really? It's like he went to sleep already, or what? Or is he outside? Ah, here he is. The Brotherhood is... Are you... But... That's not... Of course... So on the other end, the path... And I think that is it for the missing novices. Indeed, that was the last thing. Alright, so... The uh, Masia Slayer Part 2 is done. I will need to do a lot of editings because I didn't know where to go properly. But all in all, it was a fun trip to, to the other side of that area. Um, I hope you did. I did. Please leave a like if you did. Subscribe for more future videos. And as always, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.